everyone this is Amy welcome today to my channel so I am going to do another painting video in addition to doing the Ricky infused sound bath along with this video so I hope you enjoy that as well I am going to be using these sea foams that I cut into different shapes one is going to be for flower petals and the other one is going to be for the leaves and just trying a different technique something unique where I'm doing dots on my palette I am using wicker white, bumblebee, these are all folk art paints, tea berry, and hunter green. And I have these little lids that I put on so that I can actually do line, line work or shapes or dots or whatnot with those lids. And I will list everything down below. Some of my items are old, so it's kind of not too sure how, how available some of these are, but just use what you have. What I'm gonna do is take the seafoam sponge and just put it into the dots, just like that. Just tap it down into the paint. And I'm gonna just probably do a single flower for today. So you just press down, make your petal shapes, and if you want, you can go back over it. If you're not happy with how the shape turned out. And just tap down a little bit more, like that. And then I'm going to use a the other sponge to create petals. I'm just dipping it, tap it a couple times if you want, just dipping it into that. And I want my, my petals to kind of go out like that to the side, come down. You can actually either make them line up with each other as they come down or, you know, make them, spread them out a little bit if you want. All right, and then I'm gonna take the bottle which is the hunter green and draw the stem from here down and then if you want you can either leave the leaves just kind of free flowing from there without connecting them or you can come through here and, and add a connection and then as far as the center goes I'm gonna take I'm sorry I got paint all over my fingers now I'm going to take the yellow and then just kind of a little bit of uh, just sporadic kind of drawing in the center to kind of make that connection and fill it in like that. If you would like, then you can go and outline your petals outside of you know the lines I'm not going to be I don't really want them to be perfect I like to do outlines that kind of come in and out if I'm going to do this at all or you can leave this part out it's up to you but just look how fun I mean you're just creating a whimsical type of design and you don't even have to really make it to where it's solidly drawn you can do like one side if you want or you know go ahead and finish connecting them as you're working like that if you want to add a different color so you can see it a little bit better that's good too and then I'm going to come back try to do the yellow this particular lid doesn't want to work very well but I can just do like one side in the center of the leaf petals and if you don't like that then you can come back and finish up the sides or if you wanted to use green or maybe even a different shade of green that's good too but just create it and make it yours very simple very easy quick design and anyone can do it 
just a kind of a cute little craft project to try. I hope you like this short video. If you do, give me a big thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, and share this if you would. I'd appreciate it. Again, hope you enjoy it. And then from this point on, you'll just hear a sound bath if you want to sit back and relax, meditate, or just close your eyes and rest. Feel free to do so. Hope you enjoy. Thank you. Have a good one.